Willie Cartwright here from Save to Sane. One of the things, uh, statements that really drive African-American Christians out of their mind is when someone, a non-Christian or a non-believer, says that Christianity is the religion of white folks or white people or the white man's religion, however the phrasing um, goes. Uh, I'm not one of those individuals that would say that. However, I do understand why some people would say that. Uh, But I like to focus on the historical evidence, uh, archaeological facts when presenting uh, information like this. So let's take a look at why some people would say or would make that statement. First of all, Christianity was started around the first century in Judea. Uh, Judea, Judea, I think is pronounced Judea. Uh, Judea is a uh, region or was a region in uh, what we would today commonly call the Middle East. Now, I don't have a problem with individuals who say that the Middle East is really a part of Africa, East Africa. I don't have a problem with that at all. Um, And that's not a debated discussion that we will have today. Uh, However, what I will say, the most important thing is that at the time that Christianity was started in Judea, it was a a province, a, a territory controlled by the Romans uh, and the Roman government and the Roman emperor. Secondly, as Christianity started to spread uh, during the first century, it did spread into um, to what we traditionally would call Africa, in this particular case, North Africa, Egypt and Ethiopia primarily. Thirdly, uh, as, we, as most of us know, or at least I hope most of us do know, um, the, uh, the ancestors of today's African-Americans, most of the ancestors of, you know, of today's African-Americans uh, were taken uh, from what we know today to be West Africa and countries in Western Africa, uh, West Central Africa, uh, the majority of. And so Christianity did not reach West uh, Central Africa until about the 15th century. Uh, via missionaries from Portugal and other European countries. Uh, So therefore, the majority of African-Americans here in the states of this country, including uh, the islands, uh, all of the places uh, along the transatlantic slave uh, trade where slaves were dropped off, uh, all of those individuals, most of those individuals for the most part, did not get exposed to Christianity until they left the continent of Africa. Understand that Christianity is not an...